Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, we have numbers for the month of March for the uh, Windows market share. Uh, according to Steam, and Steam, of course, is a uh, gaming platform, and what they do is they randomly select a certain number of um, users and check what operating systems they're running. Um, and on Windows side, and there's kind of a big surprise this month, and something very interesting. So, of course, it's not a surprise that Windows 10 is dominating, but what's surprising is that compared to the previous month, it's 10.5% higher. It's kind of uh, very interesting and weird. Windows 11 is at 22.4%. It's almost 8% lower. It had reached 30% in the last survey of Steam, and now it's down to 22.4%. So this is kind of interesting. And if you look at Windows 7, Windows 8.1, that all lost a little bit. There's no logical explanation for such a drastic change. So is it that the random survey was just by chance surveying more Windows 10 machines? It's very weird. I was trying to, you know, because we did have numbers that indicated Windows 10 had a rise, and and that was explained by the Windows 7 um, that and Windows 8.1 that pretty much are operating systems that really are out of support now. Windows 7 had its extended support that was three years for business ended in January, and Windows 8.1 ended in January, so there was a readjustment. People were moving on. It was well, kind of normal to see people probably move on to Windows 10, which is a tried and true operating system, rather than 11, which has a lot of bad publicity of different users. But there's no clear explanation for such a big change that we're having here. And the fact also that that change is for the month of March. We are now, you know, March and January is like, you know, two months, two months later you're getting that big drastic change. So it's very bizarre and kind of not really easy to explain why these numbers have changed drastically. Um, so this is um, kind of interesting. We're going to look at the same numbers, but we're going to go to um, another, um, another provider for the numbers in the next video. We'll compare there see also if there's such a change but um you know it, it would have to be that tons of users on windows 11 came back to windows 10 on gaming i don't know it's it's these numbers are are, are tough to uh, find an explanation pop you know i don't know if it's the randomized check that maybe isn't correct or you know we're gonna have to see next month what's what's the number next month and how all of that is gonna actually uh, work out because um there's too much of a change here to explain this month right now if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching